Uh, KISW. Hey, Vicky Barcelona. Yes. I gotta ask you something. Earlier this morning, you talked about things that you've regretted posting yes. online, and what was that one thing that you said? That I posted an artistic topless photo of myself. An artistic nudie picture, BJ. What's this now? <laughs> well, remember earlier, Vicky was talking about how she posted a picture of her, an artistic picture of her, you know, naked. I mean, you couldn't see any nip or anything. I love how women say that, by the way. Artistic. They have to use the word artistic. Right. Because somehow that makes it seem less nude. Right. You it's less love, raunchy. You love women. Women are amazing. It's like, don't look at those nude right. pictures. But they're artistic, honey. Or I love, like, the girls that get all those, like, they, they say they're models and they get the naked pictures. But they're in black and white, so therefore it's artsy. Yeah, mine's in black and white, too. I figured. How about that? Well, we're getting a lot of text Steve, messages. Would you, like to, I, I, you know what? I'll take it. Let me take a picture of Anthony Wiener style, but we'll do it in oh, black yeah? and white. Are you, are you going to be in any high school yearbook? Yes, right. <laughs> Check it. Well, a lot of people are texting us at 77999 demanding to see this picture. Let me find it. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. wait. She regrets putting it online. Right. And she's going to put it on the video I blog? Oh, it's different. No one watches these. Oh, that's a good point. Yeah. Well, I regret it because my uncle found it at that point. That's why. Any family members watch the video blogs? No. Okay, perfect then. We should really tag it. Not. Let's tag it like uh, Mexican recipes. Yeah, there you go. Because maybe your family members go online and look for stuff like that. Right. What, what, what's your family into? Chimichangas. Yes. Chimichangas. Really? <laughs> really? No, chimichangas aren't real Mexican I think food. Vicky what, wait, hold on a second. Chimichangas aren't real Mexican food? No, they're Americanized Mexican food. Oh, Gringle. Just, oh, just like pizza? What about soft taco supremes from Taco Bell? Oh, those, that are, real oh those are totally real. Okay, good, because those are my favorites. Thank God, Steve. For a minute there, yeah. I thought she was just going to ruin all my yeah. dreams. Mexi nuggets. What about those? Oh, those are oh yeah, those are a staple on uh, Christmas dinner. Yeah, Mexi pizza? <laughs> Please stop. This hurts. What, what do you like better? Do you like Taco Bell, Taco Time? If you Taco had a... Bell. Thank you. I had that you, you're welcome. Wife. No, I had that argument with my wife. She likes Taco Time better than Taco Bell. Well, she I'm like, grew you're crazy. Up here. She grew up here. That was what was here. Taco Time was the joint. Taco Bell's been here forever, right, Toppy? You're from here. I am from here, and I would say Taco Time. Taco Time? <laughs> we should go. We have to do a comparison someday. There is no comparison. It's Taco Bell all the way. Like, you get like three times the stuff for your dollar at Taco Bell. I'm not talking. Yeah. Uh, yeah, but you're talking. If you want to talk about taste, I think you have to. You have to. Have you been at Taco Time? I've eaten at Taco Time plenty of times. And you don't think it? You know, I think it's great. I like Taco Del Mar. Yeah, I like times, Udoba. Taco time. But of all of them, Taco Bell is, is <laughs> by far the supreme. All right. Well. There are people from this area that disagree. What the hell is over there? What kind this of weird is, pictures are you... This isn't the you... picture, but I took this what one for my, uh, for my photography class. Are you into, like, panties? What the no. hell is happening over here? She's it's, in panties. It's cool Steve. because it's a slower shutter speed, and this room was completely dark. So when you leave the shutter open, oh, you I'm get sure a lot of light. Yeah. And then when I moved, I created this illusion, so... Yeah, but why did you have to do it in your underwear? Couldn't you create that illusion Because I was hanging out with my boyfriend at the time. Oh. oh Who wears yeah. pants when they're hanging the out with bed. their boyfriend? Uh, Top well, shelf does. I never wear pants when I'm hanging with my boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> I have pants on. I have snow gear on when I hang out with my boyfriend. You just never know what will happen. Well, I live on Capitol Hill, so you know, why waste time? Uh, right. I gotta admit, that was a good picture. <laughs> Where'd you get that? Is that picture online for it? people to see? No, these are all private. Ooh. Not private. anymore. Yeah. Here comes another one. Who's this guy? Look well, that's my ex-boyfriend. Oh, okay. And you saw pictures private. of your ex-boyfriend? Is this it? Yeah, that's it. This is the picture. Look at her. She has a sort of snooky look to her there. Oh, don't say that. Sorry, I'm just saying. That was also, yeah. I mean, she kind of, she, doesn't she sort of remind you of Snooky in that picture? No. Eh, I'm not feeling that. Well. That's like the biggest offense you could say to me. I'm sorry. You can sorry. make fun of my people. You can do anything. Sorry, but calling but... me Snooky. I, 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 it's I, a high I, thing. I, I call him as I see him. Well, he, but see, the, the long hair. She's got she an ethnic got poof, look. They should have got the poof going. I do not. It's and it doesn't what? look like a steamroller ran over her face. And you look a little tan there. Well, yeah. I used to be tanner. Yeah. Before I started Snooki's, getting to geek things and Snooki's stopped very going tan. outside. Yeah, Snooki's very tan. Mm. I'm, I'm sorry. Toppy, yeah. be the final judge. Can you come over here and check this picture out and sure. see? There we go, Top Shop. Doesn't this give you, doesn't this give you a Snooki vibe? It does not. Oh, no. And he would know. All right. But the fact that you don't like it means someone else has called you Snooky before. Well, I did dress up as a joke as a Snooky once, and everyone saw it. Like, like we went to, I think I went with Annabelle to a drag show, and everyone's like, Snooky on the main stage! And I'm like, oh, there's a Snooky here, another one? And they're all talking to me, so... 
Wait, I have wait, been. How, how dumb are you to th you dress as Snooki, <laughs> they go Snooki on the main stage, and you don't think they're talking? Well, there's guys right. dressed up as Britney Spears <laughs> and as, Steve, you know, so other things. Right. You think there's I'm, I'm officially done with this. We've hit five minutes, minutes, which means we've hit our quota for talking to a woman. Yeah. Bye. Goodbye. Bye. The BJ Shea Morning Experience on 99.9 .9 KISW.